Good morning and happy Easter. Today, I brought a caterpillar with me. It's not a real caterpillar, but it looks just like what a real caterpillar would look like. And what a caterpillar does is it eats and it gets ready to form a chrysalis. And it eats and stores energy and works really hard to be able to do that. And so what it does is it starts to form the chrysalis around its body. And then there's work going on inside this chrysalis. And it works really hard to then turn into what we know is a butterfly, right? And so the really cool thing about the story of Jesus's life is that we have no idea that the end result is going to be a beautiful butterfly, Jesus um, resurrecting from the dead. So in our journey, in Jesus's life, it's very much like the caterpillar. So Jesus is working really hard to show the disciples and his followers how to love one another and how to serve one another. And so all throughout our journey of our Holy Week, we see all these really great examples of Jesus's life and what he wants and how God wants us to live. And the really cool thing is, is that even inside the tomb, like the chrysalis, the caterpillar's working really hard and you can't see it. That's like inside the tomb. Jesus was still working and doing really great things so that we could have resurrection, so that we knew that Jesus could conquer death. He could conquer all things, including death. And so as we see, the caterpillar works really hard. Jesus works very hard to show us how to live and how to love. And then we get the resurrection, like the butterfly. And that's why you see in the springtime around Easter, you see all kinds of flowers. And that's when butterflies start to come out of their chrysalis. And so we get to see that new life, that all these things are really important, but where our faith and where our salvation is, is in the resurrection, that Jesus can conquer anything, including death. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, thank you for sending your son to show us how to live and how to serve and how to love one another. Thank you for giving us this promise of new life in the resurrection. And all God's children said, Amen.